So the the costume is all uh, kind of um, salvaged or rescued World War II straps of fabric, um, and they're hand dyed and hand sewn. And then all of these chains are some of them are antique and some of them are um, well mo they're all antique but some of them are, are res salvaged and some of them are were given to me by a, a jewelry designer who does antique chains. Um, and then, uh, so this character is part of the series of characters that I've developed, eco-feminist characters that um, perform actions in these remote locations, remote natural locations. And so she was monstrous feminine in Mexico. She was developed for a piece in Mexico in the jungle in, um, in the Yucatan Peninsula. And so she kind of merges with that, the kind of colors and, and, and the atmosphere that's, that exists there. She merges with that and kind of camouflages into that. It's sort of failed camouflage, but it's camouflage. And um, so the chains are also a reference, of course, to, you know, fem feminine adornment and uh, just, you know, hyper feminine things in general. Just a lot of chains, a lot of gold. And also being from the South, just that kind of idea of things being encrusted, like kind of a, a what's the word, um, like a decay, like a beautiful decay, or like a, a, a failed elegance kind of thing. 